This is the Gormia Digital Air Fryer. Carries a 6.7 litres capacity. Many functions to cook your desired dish using air fryer technology. Around 30 centimetres in width and length, giving it a good compact size to fit on your kitchen worktop. A crisper tray and a multi-purpose rack is included. So the features of this particular air fryer is that it has a good spacious capacity. Cord storage so you don't have to take the full cord out. Easy to clean up. An angled touchscreen. 10 cooking preset functions. A dehydrate function with guided cooking prompts. Let's set this up. During the first few uses there might be a hot plastic smell. So basically just turn it on without any food inside until any plastic smell has gone. A nice and easy to follow recipe book. And an instruction manual. That's the crisper tray, multi-purpose rack. I'm quite surprised that this basket is a good size. You can probably get a full chicken in here. The inner measurements, you're looking around 22 centimeters in width and height around 13 centimeters. That's the heat coil and the fan. Just be aware, do not overload your food basket. Takes a power consumption of 1500 watts. So make sure to wash the basket, crisper tray and only wipe inside the air fryer with a moist cloth. I believe the cooking spray they are referring to are the aerosol cans that contains propane. Do not use them in this air fryer. Just use cooking oil in a normal spray bottle. Make sure the air fryer is at least 10 centimeters away from the wall. With an empty basket, select what you like to cook. I'll start off with some chips. So select fried. Preset is now activated to 200 Celsius for 15 minutes. You can check your instruction manual for further guidance. Click start. And it will preheat for about a minute. Then add your food. A handful of frozen chips. With a spray of olive oil and let it cook. After halfway, it may say turn food. So give it a shake or flip the food over. Looks like they're all cooked. Healthy crispy chips cooked in 15 minutes. So if you don't want any food to be served yet and you wish to keep it warm, just select keep warm. Adjust the timer. This will give a light heat air circulation around the food.
Now, if you're wondering how much that cost on your electric bill, you do 1500 watts, which is the power consumption of this air fryer, and how long it took to cook, which is 15 minutes, equals to 13 pence without adding any preheat time. Cooking a piece of frozen chicken fillet. Just going to select wings. Preheat is done. Add food. Turn food. And we're done cooking. You can take out or place back the basket whenever you like. There we go guys, a super crispy chicken fillet all cooked up. Tastes so much better than frying it in the oil. And it's so much quicker than a gas oven. If you'd like me to cook any food in the air fryer and see how they come out. And if you personally have any tips of your own then jot them down in the comment section below. To purchase, see description. Stay healthy guys, peace.